Hello, and welcome to another video in the series where I attempt to recreate my first indie game with a new game design using the most recent version of the Unreal Engine. Last week I finished setting up the bow and arrows as an item that can be picked up, as well as making the arrows stick in whatever they are fired into, and the player can also retrieve them out of whatever they've stuck into. I also went ahead and added the ballistics effect to the arrow impacts based on the surface that they hit and added the same functionality to the other weapons from the survival game kit that are already set up. Since I plan to use this template for other games in the future once Age of Omens is finished, I decided to go ahead and integrate mechanics that I feel are important to any game of this type, such as farming and harvesting crops as items, lock picking, lootable AI, stealth assassinations, turrets, swimming, day and night cycles with a uh, working weather system. By adding these mechanics before customizing the survival game kit in the theme of an actual medieval fantasy game, I'll hopefully be able to use this template for future games without having to add all these mechanics all over again. So now that I have that out of the way, I feel it's time to start customizing some of the stock assets from the survival game kit so that the game has more of a medieval feel to it. So that people watching the video have a better understanding of the type of game that I'm creating if they happen to come across the channel or one of these videos. The first thing I'd like to customize is the inventory and crafting UI, since currently it's set up looking very modern. So with that, I'm going to get started and customize this with some different texture files that I've collected over the last couple years.
Okay, so as you can see, we have our new inventory and crafting UI all customized. Uh, and now I have a working bow and archery all working. Um, I also have all the basic mechanics I need to get this new version of Age of Omens underway. So thanks for watching and please feel free to give a like if you enjoyed the video. And if you want to be notified uh, when I post a video, you can always hit the bell notification next to the subscribe button. So again, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. And I'll be talking more about the actual game design and what specifically I'm going to do to change this game into something that's fun and playable. All right. Thank you. And I'll see you in the next one.